to know the love of Christ which passes knowledge. But you can't even understand how amazing the love of God is. The fact that he loved us so much that he gave his only son to die for us is just an example of that tremendous amount of love. I would die for my children, but I would never want my children to die for you. But you know what? That's how amazing God's love is. This is great in John 15, 13. Greater love hath no man than this. That a man lay down his life for his friend. This is the top. This is the capstone of love. This is the crest. This is the summit, the apex, the zenith. The very top of all love is that you lay down your life for your friend. No greater love has any man than this. And Jesus Christ laid down his life for us. You cannot beat that kind of love. If you could just take that love just a little bit, bottle it up, and just share that with somebody. God's love is so great that nothing, not you and not someone else, nothing is able to separate you from that love. Not your present sin, not your past sin, and not your future sin. Can you imagine having so much love that nothing is able to separate you from it? There's a lot of things that I worry about, right? Even though you're supposed to be anxious for nothing. <laughs> a lot of things I worry about. And it's not the coronavirus. Not worried about that. One thing I am not worried about is whether or not God loves me.